Welcome everyone, you might be in a situation where you're stuck on this page. You can, you can see checking for update and very soon it's going to say unable to check for updates. Would you like to try again? Then you tap on try again, you wait and you just don't see the brand new iOS 14 update, right? Um, I'm still on iOS 13. I want to get onto iOS 14. There you go. There's the pop up unable to check for updates. If I try again, it's not going to work. So I would like to show you in this video how to fix the unable to check for update error onto your device. There are many reasons why this can happen. So there will be a, a lot of fixes in this video. So the first thing is open up settings, tap on Wi-Fi, then tap on I. And if you have any proxy on, make sure this is disabled. So I'm going to turn off the proxy server. Now, if you're using FFApple to use TutuBox or any tweaked applications, do not open your tweaked apps until you're updated to iOS 14. After you're updated, enable FF Apple, then enable AirPlay mode before you open up your apps. Then you should be good to go and you won't get any revokes. So um, the next one is we'll go to ge uh, general. We'll go to VPN. And if you have any VPNs enabled, just turn them off because some of them will actually block the iOS update. So make sure you turn them off and then you should uh, be good. Now, if those two don't work, then we're just going to try a restart. So what you do is just hold your power button down and then we'll swipe to power off if you have a home uh, no home button device like the iphone 10 10 r 10 or Cenus max you just hold the volume down and power button together now we're just going to hold down the uh, power button and we can see the apple logo right here now if this doesn't fix it there are a couple more fixes on the way so just uh, make sure you do uh, keep on watching there are a bunch of you know things that um can happen so let's go into settings let's see if it fixed it for me so if i go to general software update there we go you can see fixed it for me however if it hasn't fixed it for you let's go through some more troubleshooting so the next thing is check if you've jailbroken before with uncover because uncover blocks updates now here's the thing if you jailbroke with uncover before then updated via a computer to a new ios and you're having an issue before, you know, had the issue before where updates were blocked, then you can't really do anything about that. You're going to have to install iOS 14 via the computer. For some reason, even if you factory reset, Uncover still manages to block the iOS updates. The only way to fix would be to jailbreak again. However, if you're not on a jailbreakable firmware, then you kind of are screwed. However, if you're running iOS 13.5, down to 13 or even 12, just open up Uncover. But jailbreak again with disable updates turned off and then just run that tool until you can see updates inside the settings. Now, if you haven't jailbroken with Uncover and you still have this issue or you did that and you still have this issue, you're just going to have to wait until tomorrow because there are so many people downloading iOS 14 right now. If you're watching in the future, maybe iOS 15, maybe iOS 16. Uh, so just wait a day, whatever, and then you should be good to go. So I'll see you guys later. And if it doesn't work, contact Apple and they should help you out. Bye-bye.